Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to the Age of Imperials mod for Hearts of Iron 4. I'm your host, Mr. Germania Lava. Oh, hey, I'm Mocha Lava, but right now, we've got some comms to go through, and this isn't where we left off last time. It's March 12, 1936, and, uh, as you can see, this is just a gigantic mess. Now, we're not at war with the Russians now, because I went back and basically played the entire episode while I was doing all the same focuses. We're not at war with the British Empire, or the United Kingdom, whatever they call themselves, but we are doing a focus called New Fighter Designs, and where is that? That's right here. There's a big race going on in the world for who will build bigger fighters. We gotta win it. Heavy fighters are needed. Heavy fighters have certain advantages, thanks to which they are able to work much better than normal fighters in certain conditions, so we must remember about their development. Followed up with uh, extensive use of the Enigma. Work on the construction of the calculating machine has been going on for a long time. If we support these tests properly, the results will be able to surprise us positively. So, as you can tell, Jesus Christ, this is insane. So, we've lost quite a few guys, and I'll explain that in just a little bit. So, basically, us versus. Oh, also, Spain did not join us this time. The Spanish actually joined the League of Nations. Go figure, with America, whatever. So we're fighting the Tripartite Pact, because the French actually declared war on us. And as you can tell, we've killed 2.1 million Frenchies. Um, actually, so the reason why we have so many casualties on our side is because originally the Swiss joined our faction, and then they got puppeted by the French, which I thought was complete BS, because they basically stole our puppet and killed off all of our man manpower and divisions over there. So that's how come our losses are still alive. We lost like 10 divisions, which sucks. Screw the Swiss. I hate the Swiss now. Uh, with the Danube Reich as well, which is led by Sir Mr. Adolf. We've been doing really well just holding out against them. We've killed off a million Italians. Awesome. So, yeah, overall, not too bad. And I did make a giant push into France, which actually at this point, we might just want to consider going ahead and doing the same thing again. Maybe. Maybe, yeah. As you can tell, they're attacking over here, which is fine with me. Like, if they want to attack us like crazy, so be it. But if we can win against these gosh darn French sons of a frog sucker, then you know what? Maybe we should. Maybe we just should. If you guys can win here, go right ahead, please. Ernst Louis, Louis von, von Hassen? Nice. Paris has been captured, my friends. We have now captured Paris within the first three minutes of the video. <sighs> Does it not feel good? Are you not entertained? Hopefully, we can capitulate all of France. That'd be great. That'd be really, really great. Um, obviously, Switzerland's going to give us a little bit of trouble. Whatever. Pretty normal. Break over the river if we possibly can. We got the manpower for it. Um, yeah. So we didn't lose any of their ships for like last time. But a couple comments include such as... Oh, Kesselonis. Um We lost ships due to our naval doctrine. Yeah, I should have realized that naval interdiction is not very good for naval doctrine for us. I just make sure we... I just did just because... Uh, While well, we started with it, I'm like, yeah, just keep going on with it, right? Oh, sausages are already rolling. Well, we'll tell you what type of sausages are rolling. And hopefully they're appropriate. Um, why not? Yeah, okay. But yeah, yeah, we lost a lot of those ships last time, but our ships are still here. We didn't lose them yet. They're still going. We got Leopard, Leopard, right? Nice. Nice. It is 36, of course, so 38. Anti-tank might be pretty good to do. Um, I'm not really used to this mod to the point where, like, I'm not sure what we can research in any given year. But we'll see what happens. Overall, it looks like we got some green air, which is awesome, awesome, awesome. Fuel is not really that big of an issue. It would help if I did give you some orders, so. Keep going. You guys are doing fine. I want you to hold as well. To really concentrate your attacks, I want you to really focus on the north. Amion would be very nice, as these guys are still attacking us quite a bit, so. Yeah, the Russians did send some volunteers to the Austrians and stuff. Wow. Alright. Ooh, that's not good over there. Yeah, I mean. As long as we can win. Oh, they're attacking us on the French front, too. Look at that. Nice. Government staff for schools. Very cool. Uh, invisible ink. I'll grab you. Go ahead and do a lot of stuff in French side. Bordeaux, please. Thank you very much. And Maximilian Hoffman. A very Germanic name. Very strong name. Cool. Anything else over here? Uh, not really, probably. Buy some fighters and demand stuff from Scandinavia. Meeting two Kaisers. Scorch the Earth. We're pretty good. Oh, what is this? Non-radical policies. More stability is not bad. War bonds. I love them. War bonds. We can do that. Oh, and also, Romania did join our faction, but they did get killed off, so... Uh, we can do that one, because why not? We can do that one. I'm not going to request a navy, because we just end up killing it. Weapons for resistance. Yes, please. And, uh, yeah, not bad. And then we'll talk about nuclear stuff. The construction of nuclear infrastructure. The concept of atomic weaponry is largely a theoretical subject, because no one's ever done it before. If we want to learn more about how it works, then we're going to need to build appropriate research centers and employ the best scientists. Just, just makes sense. I'm not, I'm not using any paratroopers yet, but in the end we will. I promise you that. So, can you go ahead and to win the battle, go there, and then go to Amiens and cut off Calais, which we will hopefully use our naval bombers and stuff like that to bomb the living crap out of them. So we have our guys here. 
Do we dare risk it? Probably not, but let's do it anyways. Can we sink a lot of the convoys that'll be flooding through here? Because my goodness, these guys just love, love, love attacking us so much. Oh, love the convoys already. Oh, hopefully find the French fleet. Oh, so many Brazilian convoys. Oh, I love it. Oh, hello. Oh, yes. Sink them and stink them, my baby boys. Oh, that's so nice. Oh, yes. Shred those daddies. And that's poor army over here. Just poor, poor army. Don't take Calais just yet. You still won. Okay. Dunkirk would be very nice. Why are you advancing in this direction? Oh, I, did I give you orders to move? Okay. I want to bait the enemies so they can bring out their fleet and I can destroy it. Hopefully. Huh. Last time we tried the same thing and it didn't work out so well. Uh, that's fine. Up out. Nice. So then they're forced into Calais. Nice. And so then everyone else here are going to have a little bit more of a struggle session. I like to cuddle with a struggle. Wait, uh, do I, can I say that? Find them subs. Find them subby daddies. And they are attacking. I mean, this is what I've been doing off screen a whole bunch. Did lose some allied stuff or whatever. Uh, more millies. Always needed. Always needed. Are we missing anything here? Uh, besides resources? Not really. We could always use more planes, probably. Ooh, tactical bombers. Tack daddies. Uh, if I call something like. I usually call them just daddies. I don't know why. I don't know what's wrong with me. Also, we did get that six research slot, which is very nice. So, um, yeah, do that too. Even more fuel. And we'll grab another city. Nuclear stuff, thank you. And let's right to that. So, ground support integration. Cool. And, uh, increased focus on air combat research. Modern war and its tactics are developing at an alarming rate, especially in such new battlefields, such as, for example, air battles. We cannot lag behind, of course. Oh, come on, keep sinking them. I want to sink more. I am greedy for your convoys. Oh, the capital's over there now. Okay, so you might as well do this then. You go over there. And you both go there. And the subby boys go over there too. Might as well just kill them off now. Process of liberalization. Advanced engines. Nice. Beautiful. Visible ink. Peter Müller. Very good. Where is Zurich? Nice. See what you can kill. And now we will try a general attack once the soldiers are on the line ready to go. Oh! 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 Yes! 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 Sank the French fleet! Peter and the Wolf. A feat of uh, Russian ingenuity. Oh my goodness. Now I can finally feel good. We lost a plane for a battleship, the pride of the fleet, four heavy cruisers, 18 destroyers. A light cruiser and some planes and ships. Yes, daddy, please. Make us happy. I, I, as you can tell, I'm very weird. Five, four, three. I don't want to wait any longer. Let's go. Can you actually win there? You might not be able to win that one. Oh, we just encircled somebody. Or, or ran somebody, huh? Le Harve. Nice going. Oh, encircled. Very good. Very good. Yeah, we're not going to win in Switzerland too much, but that's all right. Happens. Destroyers. Oh, some convoys. Very good. Oh, look at these guys. Go! Go here, and then you can destroy these guys here, too. Look at that. Uh-oh, I think the French are not going to be doing very well. That's what you get for puppet in the Swiss, you pieces of garbage. They just lost a destroyer. That sucks. Um, They do have enemy planes, which does suck. We did sink their destroyer, though. And their sub. Can we make it two subs? Please? Oh, or maybe a light cruiser? Oh, I'll take that, too. Nice. Well, we took Bordeaux. Where'd the tanks go? Oh, we did lose another destroyer, which sucks, but whatever. They're only destroyers. Pretty cheap. Well, alright. Not bad. Concept of the jet fighter. Jet fighter plans once seemed to be the most scientific fantasy, but today is known that we can actually construct them. Let's do it. Might as well. Take your breasts. Get breasts. This guy, Walter von Reichenau, is very go happy and lucky and just trying to take things out. They do have enemy planes, which sucks, but we're still doing a bang up job. I'm not gonna lie, a bang up job. Six of stores, nice. 
So when are they going to capitulate? That's my question. I feel like we've done a pretty good... Oh, hello. All oh, y'all repair. Go ahead. Alright, I guess we're fighting Afghanistan now. What happened over here? Nice, very nice. Overall, a lot better than the last episode, I suppose. <laughs> and probably going to need a... Yeah, three's not going to be enough. 23 is not going to be enough. Holy crap, that's all we have, though. 31? Okay, 31 is not bad. A lot of them are destroyed, so they should be able to be cleaned up pretty quickly. And there goes Liberia. Okay. Something for the French, but alright. And the French Republic is now gone. <sighs> three million dead. Not enough. Go in, go in, go in. Gal Schmidt. Go now, go to Nice. Istria. And Rome. Government cycle school's cool. Mines, flamethrowers, and more. Very nice. Very nice. More infantry, guys. Yes. So you guys are doing okay. As long as no one else goes to war with us, like the Russians, we should do all right. Looking pretty good. Russian Summer Olympic Games. Have, oh, watch out. We're fighting the Afghanistan people now. Watch out. Um, do that because you can. Get some more dockyards, maybe. Of course, build some more infrastructure, but still. Hey, they died. Go to Nice. Are they still attacking us? I would love to do a general attack, but that would be quite suicidal around here. Advanced armor, grab some of that too. More defense tanks and breakthroughs. Concept of the jet fighter followed up with what? Um, good old naval doctrines. Our trusted admiral seemed to have some new ideas about war of the sea, so we should be interested in this. Not a bad idea. Business at a time. Ooh, we do not have air superiority. That sucks. Well, time to get air superiority, I suppose. Uh, attack bombers, fighters, over oh, out of planes, huh? Hmm. That ain't good. I don't want to lower anything on medium tanks. Gone with the wind, very nice, very nice. We are? Jesus, where the heck are the tanks going? Holy crap. I don't want to get encircled, so. Y'all best be moving in fast. Because while we can't break through these lines that quickly, uh, kind of insane to think about that. We've already gone through all the way here, huh? And Kona? Let the infantry get in. All right, I think we've won. No, we haven't won just quite yet, but still. Yep, we took port. Bologna. If we can get Venice, we cut them off, like, and Trieste, of course, too, but still. Yugoslavia demands unification with Romania. Brennan curtails Germany. Oh. Hope they don't come try to fight us just yet. We busy. We're busy right now. Yeah, while we're not doing great over here, and we're all seeing probably hundreds of thousands of guys, uh, Italy proper is not doing well. So we already took Rome. Um, surprised we're not doing just general attacks at this point. Yeah, I wouldn't worry about that. Let the infantry deal with this stuff. We got plenty of manpower. We lose some guys here and there. It's fine. Whatever. Alrighty. And then, uh... Jefferson Germania. The current geopolitical situation does not seem to favor Germany in terms of defense. If we want to keep our factories and houses safe, we must transfer more funds to defend our borders and air zones. Makes sense. That's all I can really say about it. Makes sense, you know. Never thought I'd be going around taking out Italy this way, but here we are. Oh, I got the Italian Navy there. It's going. To, looks like something's going to have to get sinking, sinking, sinking. Oh, we're out of guns. Well, shnikes. We're out of five thousand guns. Pretty expensive doing it like this, but whatever. Fence tires. Oh, we're all done here then. After this one. I 
mean, yeah, it's very costly, but still. Going to eight. Oh, how's Italy not giving up yet, man? Yeah, they're they're doing. For, how how bad is Italy doing? Umberto the second. Plenty of manpower. Uh, stock, well, they're out of guns like us, so. Still 36. We got all that stuff done. Nice, nice. Sure. Why not? Win here and take Toronto. How much more do we need to do to kill off Italy? Oh, don't tell me we have to invade Sicily. For the love of God, do not tell me we need to invade Sicily. Palermo? Or take... Oh, no, we took all of... I don't want to give up the attacks because we're doing relatively okay, but like, bro. Bro. Ten divisions there. I want to use gas, but. Go in if you can. Let them attack us. Get them really weak as we're forcing to attack this way. Modern Blitzkrieg is nice. Backhand blow, you're probably not going to be able to beat up them over there. Yeah. It's fine. Really sure is going to die. Vorlberg will die. That'll be good. Alright, so you guys stop attacking like that. You guys hold. Interrogation techniques, nice. Getting a bug. Should be able to win there. Come on. There you go. There goes the Swiss, thank God. Hold. Uh, do we dare put our planes down there? So we're almost done with the land option too. Some better anti tank, I guess. Um. Yeah, I don't agree with that. Sicily, you shouldn't need Sicily to kill off the Italians. I hate that so much. It's so much more annoying. Uh, Fessing Germania, Germany feels threatened as it should. Uh, key point if uh, defense key coastal points. Most allow ourselves the thought that if an enemy triumphs at our sea, our coast will become a new front line. The defense of which will be crucial for survival. So now we're going to really put on a lot of fighters here. We need a lot of aluminum and a lot more military factories where we're headed. Go zero. And I don't want to do Russian Empire. Oh, actually. Can I not just do this normally? Okay, it's in glitch. Okay, whatever. Uh, this. There you go. So, when do you guys want to attack? You, these guys attacked us. I did not attack them. They attacked us, so... Von Blomberg. 5% more attack is not great. Wonders of Medicine is very nice, though. Uh, sure, we'll do that one. Atomic Research. Experimental Rockets, perhaps. And they're all attacking us. Four Divisions, no manpower. A little bit of manpower. A lot, out a lot of guns. Let's see, fighters. We need to save. Naval bombers we could probably use. Maybe as well as some casts. Because I would like to beat the crap out of enemy ships here. 
You can find them and stink them. Sink them. That'd be great. I'm not sure how much I really want to be using our ships here. But apparently they're finding some good stuff still, so. As long as we have access to the med, so. Uh, breaking the fangs of a Russian bear. The Russian army is huge and has incredible human reserves constantly supplied by the great industrial complexes of the empire, but it'll not with these waves of eastern barbarians begin to crash on our fortifications. Followed up with... Else, us Lothrum belongs to us. All gains of war with France must be maintained. Both the fortifications and minefields should be at least temporarily stopped at bottom of the frog eaters. And then you can't trust the Austrians. Given the history of our relations with Austria over the last century, we can say that we have come full circle. It will be wise in this regard to fortify our common board in order to claim that despite some diplomatic disagreements, the board will remain in place at least as long as it suits us. Alright, everyone. So we've already won the war, apparently, just because Italy actually ran out of fuel. So the Navy started sucking really hard, and well, we took advantage of that, and eventually. Well, as you can see, our tanks are down here, but, uh... They ended up abandoning Messina and left it to the Poles and Greeks, which... That was great for us. Really bad for them. We lost 25 ships. We saw 540. Let's see, current month. Uh, not bad. Uh, maybe it was last month. We were sinking a lot of light ships. A lot, a lot, a lot, a lot of convoys, too. Current year. Tons of light ships. Uh, light holes. Cruisers. Convoys. We even sunk a couple carriers as well, which is pretty darn impressive, at least in my opinion. But, you know, whatever. Um, so they're done. The war isn't over. Austria's got to die. Which there was a comment saying that you should annex Austria. And I'm like, yeah, I should. I should. I was even prepared to use some paratroopers too, but we'll get there eventually. Um, so after them, I, mm, I do want to go to war with Russia, but the Commonwealth is going to be difficult to fight as well. <sighs> but it might not be too bad actually to fight the Commonwealth because look at that. The tripartite is still over there and over here. Yeah, we might want to focus on killing those guys off next, maybe. Probably for the best. Probably. Probably. Maybe not, but probably. Well, you guys get over there, too. Cool. And we're going to head them back up here. Oh, actually. Those guys dead. You actually might be able to do something here, finally. And by there... Oh, there goes Haiti. Um, I'm talking about Czechoslovakia. Or what was Czechoslovakia at one point? So... Oh, well, oh, we actually broke through. There we go. The first... Oh, we made an incision here, too. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Please, please, please eliminate them. Come on. Uh, fine, whatever. Von Bach. It's fine. Let's try to save Russia for last. Oh... Pizen, Pizen, how do you pronounce that? Some sort of Pizen. Uh, Romania, oh, Romania's back. What we'll cause, oh, due to truces. Uh, new then, new. Oh, are you back, Romania? You're kind of back. Not really, but sort of. Um, yeah, we're not really winning here, but we're winning around here, because I did throw these guys on the line as well. So, what are we doing around here? Not bad. Air Spirit is looking quite a bit better. Nice, we don't have a lot of planes still, but it's looking better already. Awesome, 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 possum. And yeah. There you go, not bad. Nice. Keep thinking a lot of stuff there, big boys. Um yeah, not bad overall. It wasn't too bad. If we could just like go in here and cut these guys off somewhere, I would love, 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 love it. See if you guys get interfere as well. Um yeah, I did want to really pair drop into some enemies, but maybe we'll wait, maybe we'll save it for uh when we invade the UK. That actually be a, a smarter decision, actually. Huh. Probably gonna lose them all, but whatever. Oh, nice. Hey, you guys are actually cut off finally. Four divisions. Oh, look at that. Oh, thank God. Ah, get rid of the Brazilians. Nice. And I did take everything just because I didn't know what else to do. Um, so. I'm not sure if you can really, really release, release puppets or not, but... We'll see. <sighs> finally! Overall, not too bad. After Austria dies, it's all over for them. We've killed off a lot of guys. 2.1 million of those guys. 800,000 Hungarians. Uh, not too many of the Brazilians, but we don't really care about Brazil. Or, or uh, Afghans. Afghanis. I'm sorry, I don't really care. Um, not really sorry at all, actually. Uh, 36, oh, yeah. And get some better ships, too. Nice. At this point, I think they're pretty much screwed and done with. Which means we're going to have to continue focusing on our army. Or really, Air Force. So we can bomb the crap out of the British Navy in it. Airports. Hey, we won. Look at that. Nice. Yeah, there's a lot of campaigns I like to play. So I don't want to get, take Brazil. I, that's, that's really unfair. Uh, let's give it to Argentina. You can already hear the, the, the Brazilians typing into the comments. Why don't you give Brazil to Argentina? Because I don't want to deal with it. That's why. That's literally the only reason why I don't, I don't want to deal with it. And we're making some transport planes too, so. As you can tell, we're going to need more... 
Mm, what do we have here? Millies. Updated. The Junkers, 52s. Those are the transport planes. So at this point, we got to make a lot more Millies. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. But hey, not bad overall. We're still fighting. Why are we fighting Afghanistani babies? I don't want to fight them Afghanistaners. Afghanistaners, huh? That's one way to put it. Uh, I'll put you guys on the border of here. The sausages. We love sausages. Uh, put them right there. You guys go right there, too. Oh, actually, no. Because we will have to fight these guys around here as well. Because they're in the Commonwealth of Nations. Oh, boy. That can't blow. So we're going to blow and go over this direction. And get some cannons. While we're working on some of our ships as well. Get some of that, too. Thank you very much. Uh, let's come back over here as well. Get some better tactical bombers. That would be very nice. Commando training is very good as well. Thank you very much. Um, and I've been, I've just been doing some resistance suppression as well. So not much has really passed with us without me showing you too much. So heavy shot pole three, 1936 is really weird to think about that it's level three, but whatever. Uh, secondary battery. Sure. Oh, actually, we can actually do not that one. This one. Nice, there we go. Get uh, two of them. And we get rid of that one, too. Nice. And you're done with that one. There you go. Not bad. We need way more millies. We need way more equipment as well. Holy crap. Uh, Yugoslavia for now. That's fine. Yeah, I'm also get that stuff. Tungsten. Thank you, German Asia. Chromium. Thank you, German Asia. Uh, aluminum. Thank you very much. We're going to need a lot more anyways in the future. Kingdom of Siam, thank you very much. All or nothing armor. Oh my goodness. Oh, oh, we just got that one done too. God dang it. Uh, sorry about that. Thank you. Screw you. already started doing it anyways. Whatever. There you go. Going to need quite a bit of steel. Fuck both. Very nice. Uh, there you go, too. Train. Because I'm sure you guys could train. Could probably absolutely use it. So you guys do that, too. Anything else here? Yes. Oh, better Schmitz. Better Schmitz. Fighter fires. Might as well get fighter. We're fighter twos. There we are. Since we're here, anyways, might as well, right? There you go. Tree of Addis Ababa. All right. Well, all right. Whatever. Good luck with that. Mm, transfer plans are fine. Guns are looking okay. Artillery is looking more than fine for now. Not worried about that at all. Just train for now, you guys. We'll be fine. I will have to go to war with these guys before the end of the episode, but we'll see. Maybe we can make another transport here. Yeah, probably will. Um, anything over here? Infantry divisions, not bad. Psychological warfare is pretty good too. Oh, I'm just worried about buying these uh, Brits. Absolute dominance. That's what we're gonna need. Junkers 88.8, nice. Um, anything over there we really care about too much? No, not really. The air doctrine's almost done too. Jabs want greater zone of control. All right, well, good luck with that, guys. I can't promise you jack squat, but good luck. And I mean that with the best of intentions. Uh, open Sea Parade, Friends of the Reich's Pack, Scorcher's Tactics. Yeah, overall, not too bad. We just need way more planes. Cast Dose. Well, we don't have enough, so there you go. Tactical Bombers as well. Oh, the towns are going. I've been using both of these a lot more than normal. Oh, uh, naval bombers, yeah. Wait, 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 wait. I hate free trade. Why do we have selling free trade, man? Oh. Keep making more stuff here, too. Pretty beneficial overall. Yeah, but we did feel that one guy's comment. He wanted me to take out Austria, so. It is goodbye. Also, I did take over like a lot of Turkey into as well, so. Yeah, I, I didn't know who to give it to, so I just took it. Money down, just take things. You know, it works out usually for us, so. Um, planes. Oh, look at that. That's pretty nice. 
Nice. Oh, uh, yeah, we're just gonna need a lot of fighters. Holy crap. One, two, three, four. And naval bombers. You might as well train right now. These are all that fuel that we got for now. We got a lot of fighters, though. Not a lot of good fighters, but we got fighters. There you go. And you might as well deploy the chaos already. There you go. Overall, not bad. Another Schmitz. Ah, oh, very nice. Pretty nice. Pretty darn nice. So business at a time. SP artillery. We're trying to make some of these guys. It's going to come along eventually. Divisia infantry. Uh. Wait. Oh. Oh, 36 carry holes are pretty nice. Uh, so we're done with that, too. Pretty nice. Here, you can do that one. And grab some of that, too. Because you can. So we're going to do this, we're going to do that. What else are we going to do? Uh, research is fine, not too worried about that. There you go. New London School Explosion, oh boy. Um, yeah, these infantry divisions not as good as these guys. Divisia Infantria. Well, alright. Bad supply, huh? You got bad supply. I got better logistics then. We'll do the best we can. Alright, not bad. Shana, thank you. Oh my. Giddy aunt. Trade for whatever we need. We'll be fine. I mean, we are missing quite a few planes, but whatever. Small uh, caliber stuff. Grab some of that, too. Um, how, more, how much more space do we have here? Duplicate it? Yeah. Keep practicing. Keep training. Keep getting better. Great maneuvers of the, of the Polish army. Ooh, I would suck to fight against that right now. Especially if we're gearing up for war against some uh, other folk over here. Anything else? Yes. Cruise your holes. Nice. Give us some time before we can actually start making those guys too much. Uh, carriers will be fine to make right now because we do have anti air 3. We've got some armor already. So that's good enough. Don't need any extra armor. Go 3 and then go 2. That's still fine. Whatever. Goodbye, carrier th number dose. Basic sub snorkels. Get some more of that too. Sub 3s would be very nice. Goodbye. One more of those guys, and one more of those guys, and add you back on the list. You're on the list now, son. Join the club. I'm already on the list. Amphibious tractors don't really care about too much. Ooh, since we're here, let's take this off as well. Nice. Overall, not too bad. Improved live batteries ain't too shabby, too. And... Down to this again. You got stuff probably from attrition and stuff here. Um, do that, do that. There you go. Go to. All right, so who's in this faction? So obviously Belgium, um, Reich's Pact, obviously Commonwealth of Nations, Spain and Iberia shouldn't be too bad. Other than that, they're losing to the Americans. I don't know why they went to war with each other, but I'm not going to ask questions like that. Over here, which is fine, Tripartite Act Pact as well. League of Nations is fighting already. Oh, Japan's in there too, which kind of does suck, but Americans should be focused on killing them off, so it shouldn't be that bad. So. Let's go and get started. Arados, nice. It's a wee bit ahead of time, just a wee bit, but that's all right. Uh, let's do that, and let's go and do the British one, because we might as well. I read this last time, but ooh, that's what I am. The end of Pax Britannica. Pax Britannica has been going on for far too long, and every year the British seem to be increasingly removing us from the shadows. We must do a blow from which they will not rise again. Nice, as it should be. So before we actually do go to war with them, eh, get about 400 planes here. Go ahead and do that. Do your duty in the war. And blow the living crap out of them. And we have some naval bombers here too. Blow the living crap out of them. 
We do have a ships down here as well, so gotta remember that. You guys did really well. Let's grab some of that too. We'll do it for a secondary battery. They're very, very nice. Go and grab some of that. We should be okay to do stuff, but you never know. This guy's really good in defense, but I'm waiting for him to become an iron side, which I don't know if he'll ever become one. What's behind the free market? Alright, alright. I'll keep going with this up too. Defense, defensive parts and stuff. Yeah. It's time to spy a little bit on them British folk. It's not like Victoria too, where you want to invade Scotland, just hold out forever, but you never know. All right, y'all done training yet? Not yet, but soon, soon, very soon. Um, two hundred here. What do you have? Two hundred of what? Nice. <laughs> Any more torpedo strength? Yes, please. Uh, open the Golden Gate Bridge. Very nice. Aggressive attitude's gone. We lost some attack, but whatever. I just want to do well here. I just want to kill them all off. How are you guys doing down here? Doing all right? You should be able to win, especially if they're uh, yeah, not able to do too much. But you never know. So now we're probably going to lose our fleet. Bravery grows in the North Sea. If you want to do that, please go right ahead. Nice. Probably going to lose a lot of ships here. Probably not going to do stupendous, but we'll see. And, uh... Let's see. Japan. Russian Empire. You know the one against Japan. Japan seems far too interested in taking possession of our territories in the Far East. So most of these children didn't know that we're not actually a country to joke around with. Hey, don't be joking around with us, son. We'll kill you off. Okay, let's so throw you over here. Thank you very much. Um, yeah, it's probably a really bad idea to do this, but we're going to go and do this. Ding dong, ding dong, ding dong, ding dong. You're always going to go to the English Channel. All of you. You are all a bunch of close air support, and yeah, you're literally all just cast. So you guys are going to go here. And you all are just going to do this as well. There you go. There you go. Um, it's not bad. Naval bombers obviously have to go here, though. Five, four, three, two. Ah, oh, screw it. Let's go in. Can we go to war with you guys or what? Just five. Well, how long will that actually take? Develop radar. 150 days. That's a bit extreme. Yeah. That's a bit extreme. Yes, yes, yes. Eh. Oh, yep. Time to cause World War 700. We're trying to rule the waves. We better do that before Henry the Ninth can do anything. And our odds have been called in. We're going to blow them up into uh, smithereens. Oh, God, never mind. If our Japan's joined them, all right. Can we get a war with these guys, too, please, please, please? No, okay, then. Nice. Oh, please tell me it's just a plane shot down. Oh, it's quite a few planes. I have a battle cruiser there, though. Oh, we are pushing through here, too, so. Do we at least have air superiority here? Yeah, we do. We do quite a well. We did have quite a bit. Um, it looks like they're doing force defense or something. Yeah, they gotta be doing force defense, right? Oh, they definitely are. Oh, they definitely are. Nice. Well, that's one way to kill them off, I guess. Awesome planes. Shut that stuff down. Oh boy. Oh boy. What's going on over here? Oh boy. We lost a couple destroyers in exchange for a lot of convoys. Ooh. Okay, not bad, not bad. We lost five destroyers and a couple planes versus a heavy cruiser, a light cruiser, destroyers, and stuff like that. All right. We can kind of go along with that. Not great, obviously, but still. Um, no, we didn't really build up that airbase, did we? God dang it. Uh, do this one, too. Early bombers. Must be out of uh, cast. You can use bombers, that's fine. They're not going to be great, but whatever. Well, if they want to do force defense, we can do force attack. Well, maybe not. Okay, then. Huh. Holy crap. Seriously, what's wrong? Why can't we go to Belgium? Nice, like a battleship. 
And we've got the fuel for it, so... So we don't have to wait so long to kill these guys off. How many have we lost in this, in this war? 11,000, we killed off... 137,000. I'm feeling pretty good about that. Very nice. Please just go in. Cut them off. Oh, yeah. Oh, they're definitely doing force attack still. Or force defense. Or last stand, whatever they call it. Fortress Europa. Oh, my God. Just call in Belgium. For the love of God, please just call in Belgium. Bomb that British fleet and sink them. What else we got around here? Uh, got that one too, yeah. Oh yeah, they're definitely not dying without, you know, basically murdering themselves, but whatever. Jorg. Move a little faster. Von bikes. Nothing there. Hanging out for now until the Russians probably start knocking on our door. Nice, nice another task force destroyed. Good, good, good. Convoy sunk. Good, good, good. Keep going on in. They wanted this. Oh my god, please just let us go to war with Belgium. Why can we not just kill off Belgium? Uh oh. All them ships they got. My goodness. Got some more millies, which is pretty nice, even though we need way more rubber now. Ah, German Asia. Thank you, German Asia. Who dares wins? It's fine. A little better with that now. Keep up production, keep up production. We're doing fine, we're doing fine. Relax, we're doing A-OK. -okay. It's time for the Windsors. We'll see about that. Well, he did what was necessary. Well, we'll see about that as well. Subs would be good. Nice. Hello, convoys are gone. Oh, look at that! All right, we lost quite a few planes. Sunk some ships though. It's nice. Good. This is stupid. How long we have to wait to go? I'll be honest, this is, this is, I'm using console command, screw it. I'm not gonna wait, this literally makes no sense. So, if the mod developers are watching, please. It makes literally no sense why we cannot go to war with Belgium right now. I mean, seriously. I don't want to use console commands, but this is stupid. If anything, we should immediately be able to go to war with Belgium. Should immediately. I don't know why we have to do this and like, oh, they can't be in a faction. To hell with that! Are you kidding me? Are you flipping kidding me? Why do we have to wait 150 days? We should have the option to... We literally have the option of Schlieffen, right? Like, we went with the Schlieffen dude, didn't we? Yeah, in the footsteps of Schlieffen, we should be able to Blitzkrieg through Belgium. If anything, that is the one thing that Germany should be able to do. I do not understand why we have to wait. That literally makes no sense. If, uh, out of all things, Belgium is prime German territory. Nice. So... I completely disagree with that, 100%. Why we have to wait that long? But did you know there's no people, poor people in Germany? According to the doctrine of border liberalism, profits from free market activities should be distributed jointly and severely among the inhabitants of Germany so that even that the poorest of them would not have to suffer from poverty. Nice. Oh, we gotta close off the med too, so. Hey, 11 more stories sunk, good. Because I don't understand why it takes so flippin' long to justify against flippin' Belgium. It makes no sense because we need time to start Naval invading. It just does not make any sense to anyone who's, who's you know, and any just anybody. Period. You should be able to invade Belgium. You should, no matter what you do, as Germany. Belgium is just mini Germany waiting to be destroyed. Just saying. So four and another three. See what you can do from Shebog to Portsmouth. Good luck. You're gonna need it. Nice. 
Yeah, I hope you guys keep going. You guys are doing a great job, actually. Um, where is our... Ah, it's probably being used here. No? Oh. Ah, here we go. Gershman passes away. Oh, boy, that sucks, bro. Oh, that sucks, too, but whatever. Heck, if you want, you guys come down here. Oh, yeah, I guess more like probably like over here. Send you to Africa. Boy. Well, we're doing air okay in the air war, at least for now, so. Alright, got a couple while before we have to really invade, so we'll see what happens. Nice, that helped us out some more as well. Grab some of this too. And probably the next episode we'll probably try to invade uh, the USSR, so. Not bad. Amelia Earhart, goodbye Amelia. You've got to wait a few more days. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, hello. Oh, they're pulling the old sneaky, I see. They wanted to, uh... Navy invade us from there, huh? Interesting. Oh, that's a smart idea, guys. Smart idea. Too bad we're going to bomb a little crap out of your ships. And stuff like that. Oh, hello. Can't invade us. No, no, no. God. Blow them up, blow them up, blow them up, blow them up. Heavy cruiser's nice. Destroyer's nice. Yeah, the light cruiser sunk and convoy sunk. Destroyer sunk. Destroyer sunk. Destroyer sunk. Planes lost. That sucks. But guess what? We're probably going to blow them up too here. When in doubt, blow them up. Alright, so you're good enough. I'm taking you out. Come to the favorite place that everyone wants to go to North Africa. Well, that's going to help out a lot. Bracket shooting? Yes, please. Let's go in. Immediately go in. We should have enough strength to do this. All right, we're going, boys. We're going. We're off. We're off to the UK. You and me spawn gas on gas offensive combat provinces. Go, go, go. We're actually doing it. Of course, it does help that. How are we doing so well here? They do have a lot of planes. They have a lot of planes. But soon they ain't going to have any ports to use them. So, actually, since you both landed, so you just once left front. So, we took out that radar, and they can't do anything now. Nice. Move on up in the world, please. Thank you very much. Good. Well, we've landed. Alright, that's going to be a really stupid idea. Everyone go in. Go, 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 go. <laughs> there are no poor people in Germany. What are you thinking? And the one about naval bombers. Support from the air at sea seems to be an increasingly important factor in naval battles. If we want the advantage to be on our side, then we should be interested in uh, further developing our sea bombers. Yeah, probably a good idea. Happy 37, everybody. It's weird that's already 37, but whatever. Go and do that one, too. Anything over here? No, yes, no, yes, no. Uh, you guys are doing great, but you might want to get Plymouth. That's pretty important to get. I said we use naval bombers here, but apparently that was a lie. Or not naval bombers, but like fair troopers. My bad. My bad. They haven't got any more planes. Oh yeah, subbies. Subbies, you know what? I, you know what I like with my subbies? I like a little bit of a chubby. So, okay, that's kind of weird to say, but whatever. Snorkels would be nice. Get some radar, though. There you go. Oh, god dang it. Oh, I'm not going to make it then. Holy crap, we need a lot of steel. But that's why we invade Britain. Oh, hello. Look at this. Nice. Oh, we lost some planes. That sucks. Uh, whales? Whales exist? <laughs> well, not for longer. So the way, only way we're really going to be able to capitulate uh, our enemies is if we're going to, uh, well, basically, probably going to have to kill off uh, Russia to get to there. So, so we'll see. God, these things are just not worth making. 
big and heavy. Nice. Beautiful, my friends. Absolutely beautiful. So after this focus, so let's get, oh, hello. Oh, the right side of the focus view is completely. Oh, look at that. What is this? Secure the Benelux board. Oh, we, oh, that was fast. Holy crap. A lot faster than I thought it would be. This is just in case. The Russian bear seems very greedy when it comes to Europe. It would be wise to treat him with their steel. Good luck. Don't die. Oh, you can just walk over there. Oh, that's kind of nice. Well, if that's the case, I guess we're going to head on over here now, too. God dang, you look really ugly, Romania. That looks really disgustingly ugly. Uh, how are you guys doing in Africa? Doing all right? Yeah? Doing okay? Oh, hello. Well, that's not good. Well... <laughs> Could use more steel. Hmm. 39, 39, 30, 48. Well, at this point, I guess, really. All I care about. Wow. Commonwealth of Nation looking pretty white. I guess, really, these guys. I guess next. Sucks to be trying right now, though. I think there'll be one more episode in this campaign. Let's make it one more. Wow, that is extremely risky, just throwing all your bodies in the water. That is kind of dumb, not going to lie, but whatever. I guess I did it. <laughs> Still have enough fuel for now, though. Uh, what's on this side? Is there anything what we already have? The crisis is worse than uh, the relationship between us and our allies, and it led to worse than the situation in our colonies. We need to organize a large aid program. We want our empire to be in good shape as a metropolitan... Metropol metropolis... Metropolis. It's up and expand our intelligence activities in order to keep them in check. Alright. Uh, getting up from our knees. That kind of sucks, but whatever. We'll get that one done as soon as possible. Oh, excuse me. Who does not have enough goods for us? You son of a rattlesnake. Why don't you have enough goods for us? China. Great, great Hong Kong typhoon. Oh, sucks, bro. Sucks to hear about that. Yeah, that's not true of this guy's China. 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 Help us out with that. Uh, Argentine Republic, no. There you go. Nice. Well, since we're here... Everything's positive except for speed. Nice. Very expensive, but it'll, it'll work. Should work pretty darn well for us. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, would you all like to kill these guys off? I mean, you're just kind of standing there. I'd like our country back together, please. Well... Doing this is going to be really bad. I want to fight through these guys. I just want to fight through Russia, maybe. Probably a really dumb idea, but let's see. Because these guys are all allied. We're going to lose Constantinople. We'll have to keep one army down south. Probably really a bad idea doing it like this, but whatever. How else are we supposed to fight Japan? I mean, seriously. Yeah, it's going to suck. We're still fighting down here, too, so. Sausages. We love sausages. Yum, yum. Yum, yum, yum. Tanks, come on. You're gonna have to be on the front line, son. You're gonna have to be on the front line. Uh, I've not really done too much on this side at all, have I? Oh, no, I've not. We need way more planes around here. Some better air bases, too. Oh, boy. Uh, since we have planes on this side, they're all fighters. So, take one, two, three, four, and there you go. Nice. You're all pretty good. Fighters, fighters, fighters. You're literally all fighters, except for the close air support. Uh, there you go. Still got some stuff over there, but whatever. 
Um, cool. We got 400 here. Got another 1,000 right here. Toss them on over over here. Let's see a couple more planes around like that. Oh, a lot of scout planes. A lot of garbage bombers, I'll say that for sure. Early bombers, not much of these guys, but that's alright. Cool. But after that one, the Russian thing, and we'll do that focus as well up here. And repairing Middle Europa? Yeah, I could probably do that one next. It's high time to deal with the situation in the countries around us, which have often suffered even more than we did as a result of the crisis. And the difficult situation of our colonists. Yeah, that's what it was first. Our overseas territories need considerable investments to be able to return to the pre-crisis state and help be useful in upcoming wars. But if you enjoyed the video, leave a like. Subscribe if you're new. Check out my Discord link in the description below. I'm not really sure if we'll actually like kill off um, Japan. But at least in the next episode, we'll probably already begin the war against the, the Russians and our allies. But we'll see what happens. Thanks for watching. Have a tremendous, tremendous, tremendous rest of your day.